So you heard the news yesterday that Bradley Carnell was fired by City SC. As I said last night, after leading an expansion team to the Western Conference title, I don't think he forgot how to coach. Their roster, because of injuries and defections, was not electrifying. I spent some time with the coach this morning. He has received about 80 encouraging texts, some from his players. He knows with three wins and 20 matches, he didn't do enough, and that's the way pro sports goes. But to give you an idea of what kind of man Bradley Carnell is, I asked him if he plans on watching the City SC game tomorrow. Oh, 100%. Yeah, no, 100%. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Probably if I could go to the game, I would. You know, I've been, I've been to, you know, I'm part of the city. I'm part of the culture. Um, the city have embraced me. Um, you know, I'm a Blues fan. I'm a Cardinals fan. I go to the stadiums. Um, nothing should change now my relationship with St. Louis City. Um, I'm a fan for life. And something kind of interesting on his street. A week ago, there were nothing but City SC flags hanging at many of these houses. Today, there were fewer flags oh. hanging. Kind of a support for I just don't for understand Bradley. this, Frank. I, yeah. guess, I mean, I understand they struggled, but in his expansion year, I mean, he did an amazing job. And I think with the roster and the talent he had available this year, he should have gotten a chance to, to redo it. But it's pro sports, and it is only three wins and 20 yeah. matches. And he really made this a part of his community. He did. I mean, he was at racetrack. He was at Cardinal games all over. He was an ultimate St. Louis sports fan. Mm. All right. Thanks, Frank.